Hello all, this is Koki Lavani from Department of Costume Design and Patient at KSR College of Arts and Science for Women. Now I am going to discuss about buyer-seller relationship and buyer-supplier relationship. Let's see the first topic, buyer-seller relationship. The diets are derived into three, transactional relationship, value added exchange, collaborative relationship. Factors for successful interaction, style of exchange and content of information. Transactional relationship focus timely exchange of basic product at a competitive price one time only exchange and less loyalty to particular supplier little interest to external relationship transactional relationship preferred when availability of many supplier stable supply market purchase decision not complex purchase considered less important for achievement of firm objective, for example, stationary material. Transactional relationship advantage and disadvantage. Advantage of transactional. Relatively less purchasing time and effort required to establish price. Lower skill level of procurement, personal requirement. Can react quickly to exchanging market economical condition. Disadvantage of transactional relationship. Expanding and motivating income quality, provision of minimum service by supplier, supplier not motivated to invest time and energy for development of buyer product, less effective performance by supplier. Value added exchange, complete understanding of the present and future needed of customers and meeting the needs better than competitor. The groups made by selling trips. There are three groups A, B, C. A group most profit potential customer. B groups is between A and C and C least profit potential customer. Collaborative relationship. Building a strong social and economical service and technical ties between customers and supplier frame. Purpose increase value and lower total cost and achieve mutual benefits. Joint problem solving and integrations of process of two companies. Two important factors are there, trust and commitment. Collaborative relationship advantage. Long term contract. Reductions of risk for supplier. Reductions of total cost. Improvement of process. Improvement of product. Increased investment in R&D. Better focus on customer need. The second topic, buyer and supplier relationship. Purchase supplier relationship. A natural of relationship major influencer, ultimate value and customer satisfaction. A superior focus of supplier important asset. A sound marketing policy, development of goodwill. Goodwill, the brands, advertising and regular calls by salesperson. Relations of marketing. Concurrence in supply chain can be achieved by purchaser. Maintain friendly relationship with supplier. Regularly measures satisfaction level of its key supplier. Best purchase practice knowing supplier business more than supplier own employees. The ability to develop effective working relationship with Supplier will be depend on supply ability to develop effective working relationship internally. Thank you.